Hello. In this video, today we will discuss about the HTML and CSS, which it is the shortcut from cascading style sheets. And with both, we will create a web page. Our story will be about the fitness. I will use that picture to create the the web page i will use the visual studio code for editor and uh, i'll open the folder I, the fitness one I will add a new file which will be HTML index and we'll start with the first line. Doc type HTML close the tag open the tag with the brackets and it will be the html length from language and there is english close the tag And we will have also the, the head. And this will be our uh, title for, uh, for web page. Let's say fitness. The picture is part of the fitness. Fitness gym. gym page and I will add uh, one more file because he says yeah, I said I will use also the CSS And um, CSS, I will um, add the, the margins, which will be zero padding, the padding. Uh, controls the empty spaces between the elements of the content so also zero and uh, the font family for our page let's say sans serif Colon. Now I will go back to the page to our page, the HTML page. We will create a link to style CSS. Link related. It is the File sheet good over here. 
href style or page style dot css I'll close the tag All right. in a body which will be our content open the tag the tag be a div class let's say will be banner I'll close the tag go back to to, to style CSS page the banner class We add it with hundred percent height hundred H and the uh, background background image which will be linear gradient let's say colors will be Zero, 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 seventy five, zero, zero, zero. And our picture, which is name and now background. background size cover and the position for it background position will be the center now if we want to check how it's going on right click on the index html copy path open the browser paste open and this is the page with we created Till um, till now, we go back to index page. We want to grow up our uh, our page, and this page will create other other class. It div class. Let's say not bar 
close the tag um, inside and this will create an unsorted list and inside the unsorted list we will add some kind of list items with few anchor which we have let's say um, home we can copy this this part we'll paste and also we want to edit more And now we can change from here because we take it with copy and paste. Let's say calisthenics over here, also aerobics, and uh, the last one will be classes. We go back to, to style and for um, class uh, navbar we'll get some properties for it will be in 85% semicolon margin the auto padding there is 35 pixels which is the standard some kind of standard images Um, display there is flex um, line items center Line, I made a mistake. Line item center. Justify content. And the dialogue also here is with space between. And now, if we want to to see how it's going on go back to the browser it is our image get and refresh and we will have the now bar home calisthenics aerobic and aerobics in the classes now we want to arrange we want to arrange our content in a page to be more readable more nice and for it we go on with um, 
not bar unsorted list list item and for it we will choose the list style let's say none the display will be or maybe inline block it's more nice to have it all together in a, in the same line and uh, margin zero twenty save we'll go back to browser refresh and as you can see all they are aligned horizontally but maybe it's better to change also the colors for it now it is some kind of blue it's a little bit ugly and uh, again now bar unsorted list list item and now it is anchor open the brackets and uh, let's say text decoration we have to choose choose something let's say it's better none next one will be the color color let's choose this one and uh, want to change also the text we'll take the text transform and for transform maybe it's better to have it uh, the uppercase now save I go back to browser refresh and this is the our style now this is for now the first lesson to how we can create the web page starting page for our website using just only the HTML and CSS cascading sheet style sheets See you next time where we, when we continue to go further with our uh, web page. Thank you for watching. See you next time.